I feel like we've all been there. Wake up in the morning, go on your phone for a bit, then you look at the time and it's early afternoon and you've done pretty much nothing. All we know is that we've wasted half a day. At this point, you then have two options. Either you can say, oh, half a day's already gone, Matt's always waste the rest of the day. Or you could turn the day around and make something of the rest of the hours that you have in the day. Which is what we're gonna be doing today. <laughs> Everyone's been raving about CeraVe for like the last month now. I did buy some CeraVe stuff a few days ago. As you saw in the shower, I used the CeraVe hydrating cleanser. And then after I do my cleanser and toner, I'm going to be using the CeraVe moisturizing lotion. I'm using this for the past few days since I bought it. And honestly, I've got nothing but good things so far. Especially the moisturizer. It makes my skin feel so hydrated and soft since I've got naturally quite dry skin. And I've just been honestly loving this. So CeraVe is a yes for me. So every bottle is kind of funky because you have to like twist them before you can actually press down, which is kind of cool. This is a little rock that I decorated the other day. I bought this book last week because I've heard so many good things about it on Instagram and seen it on over my Pinterest feed. And honestly, this book is such a good investment. I have no bad things to say about it. I haven't read all of it yet, obviously, but so far it's been amazing. I recommend this book if you want to be the best version of yourself. Lighting candles literally makes me feel so happy. So it's been about an hour since I started having a more productive day and I'm actually gonna go and have lunch outside and have a picnic and get some fresh air rather than having it inside. Things just to spice things up a bit and plus fresh air makes me feel so much more productive, makes me feel more accomplished. So this will hopefully help me to get in the right mindset when we come back from our picnic because then I'm gonna be making my to-do list and getting on with some productive tasks, basically just homework, so yeah. <laughs> So I'm back home now. I actually was out for quite a while. It's like quarter to seven. I know. But my mum tends to sidetrack and we end up staying out for ages. But we're back home now and that's good because I did have a lot of time outside. But now I'm going to be having a quite productive like couple of hours. <laughs> First of all, I'm going to make my to-do list. Usually I make my to-do list on Notion, but I think today I'll do it on paper. So I'm just going to write it in this little notebook here. One thing that's pretty important for when you're making to-do list is not to write too much on it because one, it's like overwhelming because you feel like you have so many things to do. And also if you don't get everything done, which obviously you probably won't, it's just unrealistic to put too many things on your list because you're just not going to get everything done. Like it's just not going to happen. So you tend to feel really bad about yourself afterwards if you don't get everything ticked off because you feel like you haven't been productive. And in fact, you probably have. So I'm going to be keeping it quite simple and straight to point and just putting down things I need to get done and so yeah okay so this is my to-do list for this evening I have got three bits of homework to do so I need to do my French translation homework my history storyboard homework and then some RE Christianity homework and then I also need to ed edit my current YT video which I'm editing at the minute I've got like my books and stuff I need for this little homework session I've also put the list on Notion just for a record. That took me forever. It is a little while later and we completed all three homework tasks so I'm feeling very accomplished. I've done my RE history and my French so 
So to think that earlier on today I was just going to plan on wasting the rest of my day is honestly such a nice thought to think that I've turned my day around and look where we are now. So I also just had my dinner and I had like couscous, roast beef and some vegetables and now we're going to have a self-care evening. So I think after a day of being productive, especially because I did turn my day around and I made it a productive day in the end, I am going to reward myself for having a very chilled, cosy evening. So accomplished right now. First things first, we are going to go and wash my hair because it it's just not in a great state right now, as you can see. Yeah, let's go wash my hair now and get it all sorted. So it's much later now. It's about 10 o'clock and I've done everything I wanted to do for this evening. I've washed my hair and stuff. It's in plaits now, so it's nice and maybe tomorrow. Um, I did pack my bag and stuff. I've done my COVID test and everything like that. I'm just going to sit down and edit my video for a bit and hopefully I'll take that off my to-do list. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and hopefully you now know that a half-wasted day does not mean a full-wasted day. I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye guys! <laughs>